Did you know a simple shipping mistake at the CDC nearly caused an Ebola outbreak in Atlanta? In December 2014, virologist Dr. Jennifer Walsh was working at a lower security lab when she received what seemed like a routine sample delivery. She opened the vials wearing standard gloves and a basic lab coat, nothing more. The samples were supposed to be dead, inactivated Ebola virus for research. But as she examined them under the microscope, her blood ran cold. These weren't dead samples. The virus was alive and extremely dangerous. She had been handling live Ebola without proper protection for over an hour. Within minutes, hazmat teams swarmed the facility and sealed it completely. Thirteen scientists, including Walsh, were placed under emergency monitoring. For two terrifying weeks, she watched for any sign of fever or bleeding. The investigation revealed shocking bureaucratic failures in the shipping process. Even worse, officials later admitted this wasn't the first deadly mix-up. Multiple dangerous pathogens had been mishandled and quietly covered up. One mistake nearly unleashed a pandemic in America's largest city.